continue our kickoff countdown today in Van Alstine, where the Panthers have something to prove, and they'd like to do just that in week 11. The Van Alstine Panthers have become regulars in the high school football playoffs, but once they've made it, they haven't had a whole lot of luck. They're 0-3 in the postseason over the past three years. This season, they want to get back in and then do something when they get there, and they know what it will take. Work hard. Um, try to make it two rounds deep, not get out the first round. Uh, make a new tradition of doing that. We've always been told, you know, first round's great and everything, but you got to go farther than that now. Well, this program really wants to accomplish 11 plus. We want to get a by district championship trophy. We want to want to go pretty deep in the playoffs. That's our expectations. We've been eliminated in the first round uh, many years in a row now. Uh, we want to just get past that that uh, bump that we've had. Uh, and just keep on going past that. The Panthers lose some playmakers at receiver, but their offensive line returns, and so do their top two running backs. VA could take to the ground this year. Our O line is pretty experienced compared to what it was last year. Our running game is is pretty fast, so uh, hopefully we'll we'll come out a little more experienced on offense. We lost some of our. Uh, our deep ball threats with some kids that we graduated. So we're kind of changing things up to utilize the kids we have coming back. You know, obviously uh, with Drew coming back, who's a kind of a dual threat quarterback and both of our running backs coming back, I would say that, you know, hopefully our running game would be a little bit ahead of, of where it was last year. And it should be a good year there. Tomorrow we head to Gunner and visit with Jake Fazell and the Gunner Tigers. Gunner made it to the regional finals last year. They're hoping for another big season this year. We'll hear from the Tigers tomorrow. The